So now, after your uh invoice class, be able to your use invoice, be able to write the invo invoice, be able to write the address, be able to write the i the label item quantity price total. The next is going to write the uh you know the items. All right, the items are vectors. We analyze inside the item because in your experience go to shopping, you know you take a toaster to the cashier when they scan it, the system will receive the product name and product price. And when you scan three times, and it will give you the quantity or one time or so. It will be a toaster and unipride. It's a product, but once it go to cashier, will become a line item class because that time it will provide the quantity and the total. Because you buy one toaster, the price is different from buy three toaster. All right. So this is not appropriate. Put them all together. Instead of we should have a class is product class. So. That's what I want you to do right now. Add a source. Right click it. I want you add a class. Is okay. I want you add a class, and I'm going to move this a little bit uh, uh, bigger right now. <coughs> Call product. It's okay. Product. So we are writing this product class. So as I told you, the product. Product has a name, item name, and price. So that's right like this right now. Okay, private. The private you going to have a string, and is pro uh, is item name. How about that? We just going to call item name. Okay. And of course, I have to include string. It's okay. All right. Once I in string string, then I'm fine right now. So the first thing is a item name. Is okay. Oh, sorry, lowercase. All right. I got first one right now. How do I spell right? All right. Let me see. All right. All right, so gentlemen, I got a, I got my product. Okay, so so first is item name, and I want I want to put this uppercase. Okay. So a product also need what? Twenty nine ninety five is the price, and that's a double. Can you do like that, please? So I I'm done right now. So I I realize my product, I my product are actually. Have two property. Now I'm going to write my constructor. Okay, constructor. I need to put public. Okay, and first is my constructor. Is okay. So let me write my constructor right now. And just easy, just uh same name. Okay, uh exactly the same name, product. All right, and the product exactly there are two thing, two thing. Okay, so I'm going to say. Uh, string. Um, you know. Uh, let me just put a uh, name. How about that? Okay. In double, I'm just going to put a price. It's okay. Easy, easy. All right. I'm going to put like that. All right. As soon as I finish, I'm coming back to right here to write it, and that will be easy. You already know that will be uh your uh item name. Item name will be uh initialized from your input name. Hmm. Okay, and your uh price is going to be initialized from a price, the input a price. Okay, so that that is uh 
your constructor do. When you finish and we come in see our product CPP is okay. Our product CPP is like this. We done. That's all right. So that's your constructor. Your constructor does is you basically initialize. You get input. You get input. Uh, from your uh, you know, from the user and assign to it. Okay. So far, okay. The product fine. Let's go product CPP. Uh, H fine again. So that's my constructor, right? After my constructor, I I need to be able to get item name and get price. All right, so I'm going to write like this. Okay, I'm going to string get a uh, item name. Okay, I'm going to get item name. Okay, I'll be able to do that. And uh, right, then I also need to be able to get a uh, price and oh sorry double. And it's called get price. Is okay. Get price. It's okay. Everybody. I need you to be able to do that. So I'm just going to uh I'm just going to go to my CPP to write it. It's okay. So I know I need that. Okay, get item and get price. I'm just going to go to my uh product CPP to write it. Let me let it go. Uh, help me. Uh, uh, hold on. Let me. <coughs> Sometime they okay. Pop out, and let's come right here. The other one to pop out too. <coughs> Sorry. Sometime. All right. Mm. All right. So I can pop out right now. So hey. Uh, that's easy. Get item name. Get item name is very easy. It's just return item name. Okay, that's it. Mm -hmm. All right. So, uh, get item, get price easy. Return price. All right. So far, okay. So my get item name. I just return item name. I get get my uh uh product. I just get my price I just return price all right so I'm coming back right here get my product CPP so I finish right now I finish this all right so so far okay to you all right <clears throat> Uh, gentlemen and ladies, are you here right now? Are you here right now? Now, uh, I I actually uh, cannot do anything with this product. You know, because product go with line item. It's okay. Product go with line item. Okay, so far okay to you, everybody?